J drone here, Barry drone there. What's up guys? So check out these propellers. I'll try to keep my big fingers out of the way, but check out these propellers, man. Um, propellers are chewed up. Last flight, I did a time duration where I kind of like walked behind it, flew it around, also a video uh, a video test on the camera. Um, and uh, it flew well, even the, even the video, despite the fact, look at these blades, dude. Despite the fact my chopped up blades from two flights prior, I landed it, it kind of wobbled before it sat down, kind of shifted and then hit a bunch of tree branches off to the right and that's how they chewed up. But it's still able to fly like this. But uh, I, I want to go ahead and get these blades changed. I'm going to show you how to get the blade changed. You need a one, a one and a half hex. And we're just going to take this off. We are going to hold the motor and then twist out, twist out, and twist out. And we're going to do the same thing with this one. Hold the motor and twist out, twist out, and twist out. I would think that's up high enough let's get these screws out screws are out so this i believe is going to be a two stage or three stage two stage but three piece you're gonna have this top piece that's gonna pop off you're gonna have your motors that are gonna pop in there let's see if i'm right we're gonna take this yep that's exactly what happened um so actually here we're gonna take these off take these off and they're labeled l i don't know if you could see that you definitely could see that they're labeled l so we're gonna grab two l blades which I got right here. And uh, Ferry sent me these. I'll let him know. Like, yo, this is what happened. <laughs> and uh, they sent me these. Hopefully, they'll be readily available when everybody else has this drone. Um, and we're just going to go ahead and set this back on here. Okay. And uh, let's just make sure we are lined up. We are not lined up. We're almost lined up. Let's see. We are lined up. So this is going to be pretty simple. That's that's one set. We now have clean propellers. <laughs> we have super clean propellers compared to what we just took off. Uh, that was the worst of them that uh, had that nice little chip in it. So this should go fairly simple. We are going to hold the motor. We are going to put our one and a half here. And we are going to round and round we go. Round and round we go. Should be one more. Bam's up. So about three times. Three full, full uh, twist roos And you should be good to go. Three full twist twist rows. There's our third one. Then just snug it on and snug it on. Okay. Bam's up. Good to go. So we got two more to go, guys. Um, if this one is marked L, that means this one is marked L. These are going to be marked R. These are going to be marked R, as you can see the R right there. So we are going to do the other L. We're going to cross from one another and do the other L. And we we'll just spin out, spin out. Spin out, it should be good. S spin out, spin out, spin out. So the number's been three. Three spin outs, three Titans should be good. We're gonna set those there. We're gonna pop this up. And again, all you need to do here is pop that up and then pop that up. So those are popped up. We're gonna grab more L blades and we are just simply going to pop that down. We are going to pop that down, and we are going to set this on top of here. Make sure that's on there. Make sure that's on there, and then we just need to match up the holes and make sure they match, which they do match right now, I believe, if I can get it steady. We're going to get these screws back in there. Bam's up. Bam's up. And we will tighten these. Three. Number is three. That's three. We're going to go one, two, three. Then we're just going to tighten down. And tighten down. Almost done, guys. We got two more to go. Again, we are just going to come over here and. Three and three. Bam, they both fell down. Don't want to lose those screws. They're right there. And then we're going to take this off. We're going to pop these out. I'm going to grab our blades, which you can see. Our blade. You can grab our blades. And you will have to excuse my dirty paws. Um, I have a UTV outside that I play with. 
I also have uh, two Cadillacs that are both older than me. Um, one of them is pretty pristine, but the other one uh, is not a... Uh, I'm not going to say it's not a prize car. It's pretty much a prize car, but uh, the other one uh, is a little bit rougher. The pristine one I call beauty. The other one I call beast for very good reasons. And we're just going to twist this on. But... I know a lot of guys, uh, not a lot of people, but some people have been very perceptive. Be like, geez, Jadron, why'd your hand so dirty? Well, Jadron doesn't just sit around in a house and knit. <laughs> if I'm not playing with drones, I'm usually outside getting my hands dirty. Um, so that's that's the reason there. So I know it's kind of up close on my hands, and you can probably see the grit. Yeah, you can see you know, the dirt particles kind of like embedded in my hands. Um, that's why. All right, so here we go. We got... Uh, Let's see, we got two more to go. And let's see, make sure they're gonna fold in. Make sure I didn't tighten them too much. Fold in, this one seems a little tight. This one seems a little tight. Um, that should be fine though. No. One more to go, one more to go. Two more blades in here. Look at, look at, these, look at these grass stained chewed up blades. Um, that, 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 that right there, this one was the worst of them. Um, two more to go. Let's go. And I'm going to keep those blades just in case for some reason that, uh, I decide to chew these up worse and I need backup ones. Uh, we are going to loosen. That was one loosen. One, two, and three is the lucky number. And we need two more on this side. Come okay, on. One, two, done. It should pull up as it did. I'm going to put that down. I'm going to, again... Just pop these off the post and pop these off the post. I'm gonna pop these on the post and we're gonna pop these on the post. And we are going to set this down. What, what, what you're doing when you're putting this on, you are setting the center hole. If I can get this to sit. That center hole there, you're putting that over the post. So, and then you're just spinning the motor until they match up. Then you're dropping your screws in. Easy as pie, easy as pie, guys. We're going to, which I don't know where that expression comes from. I wonder where that expression comes from. Easy as pie. I don't think I can make a pie easy. Maybe easy as eating pie. I could eat pie all day. Um, but we are going to go over here. We're going to spin on, spin on, and one more. Bam. Three is the lucky number. One two three and we're just gonna lock down and we will again lock down should be good to go good to go good to go good to go we are good to go guys i'm jadron if you haven't subscribed please do if you uh if you decide to uh chew up your propellers and need a blade instant installation we get rid of these although like i said i'm gonna keep them just in case um now we are fresh like a brand new fresh pair of shoes on a ferry later